What's up guys and welcome to my review of the Sandberg Solar Power Bank XL. So you've got two options when it comes to charging with this device. Of course you can use the solar power option using direct sunlight or of course you can charge it via USB. So the power bank has a pretty cool design in my opinion, it's quite similar to the Apple wireless keyboard in a way. The solar panels seem to be easily scratched which is a little bit disappointing but it's not a deal breaker. We've got these four LEDs which indicate how much charge you have and whether the sun is having an effect on it. And they're not the brightest to be honest guys. I do like the minimal Sandberg branding however. The two torches are a nice touch and give off a decent amount of light. I like all the angles you can get with the stand but the plastic it's made from just feels a bit weak and it feels like it could easily grind down. Port placement and relevant info is a definite win. There's a good placement and size for the power button. Guys, it is so satisfying using this product. Just plug it in and you are charging using the power of solar panels and the sun. Using solar power has got to be the way forward, guys. I only charged it the once using electricity and you can imagine it works fine with that option too. It can take around 10 to 12 hours to charge fully using the panels, but to be honest, after having it in direct sunlight for only a short time, I had enough power to charge a device as well as the battery itself. Brilliant. But please do bear in mind guys that this power bank really does need that direct sunlight in order to charge properly. You may still get an indication that it is charging when it's not in direct sunlight, but it's not charging enough to power your device really guys. So there's a 5000 milliamp hour battery to charge inside the power bank from its full capacity and I could get about one charge of the iPad 2 with it as well. So I think this is a fantastic product for having in the garden, say if you're having a barbecue and you need to power anybody's mobile phone or maybe a Bluetooth speaker or something like that but also you could use this for camping and it could prove absolutely essential in some kind of really remote situation but what do you guys think be sure to let me know in the comments below thank you very much for watching I really do appreciate it please like the video if you did so and why not subscribe for more I'll talk to you in the next one